As Utah experiences that massive growth, the need for housing is bigger than ever. Boy, is it. A developer now wants to build a very large condominium complex in a busy section of Orem, but neighbors there are pushing back. John Franke is in Orem with a look at the plans as well as the concerns. Hi, John. Well, hey guys, Orem is the most densely populated city in all of Utah County, and a developer wants to add to that by building that six-story condo complex on the site of this used car lot. Now, neighbors here say push back, they pushed back at tonight's meeting because they say this just can't work. It's been in the family since it was homesteaded when Orem was, before Orem was Orem. Catherine Christensen's family has seen plenty of changes to Orm since her ancestors settled here. A portion of a building that was taller than 35 feet. What's on the table now has her ready to fight. I'm, I'm disgusted because this has nothing to do with what the residents want. Catherine isn't the only one. It is not great in this location on this little tiny lot. Jill Barrick is organizing a petition against the development. The architect and the developer have greatly underestimated exactly how the public feels about this. The multifamily development this is the plan that has these residents fired up. Phase one would build dozens of condos on a plot of land near 1600 North and 400 West. The city is planning on creating a median. Hundreds who live nearby came to confront those who are behind the development at this public meeting. All that traffic is going to wind back around. If you're going north, you got to turn and come. If you're going south, you got to turn and come around. They believe the traffic and parking issues will not only be a nightmare, but a hazard. There is no way that there's no impact on 400 North. The architect did most of the speaking on behalf of the owner. He saw an opportunity with um, the the zoning that was that was created to incentivize mixed use development in these areas. But that owner and developer, Dennis O'Brien, spoke when residents demanded he take the microphone. Really? I'm sorry, how much? It's not up for sale. Oh. Those words are not what these residents wanted to hear. And we want to be in charge of deciding what's going to go here. And not who has the most money and who can throw things up. Hales Engineering. And the Orem City Council is set to meet tomorrow. Many of the residents who spoke tonight say they plan to have their voices heard at that meeting as well. Reporting live in Orem, John Franke, Fox 13 News, Utah. John, thank you. Phase one of the development called the Lofts at 16th plans to build a mix of 47 condos and townhomes. The properties would be owner-occupied.